OK, so this video shows you how you can enlarge text in a certain app on your iPad. Now, for instance, say, for instance, we went into emails and we wanted the text enlarged just on the emails. Nothing else. Sometimes you might find the some emails, especially ones that are in HTML format, which the text just isn't enlarged on. So we've got this one here, for instance. It's a, uh, a scam email, but um, let's just have a look at it and just see if we can enlarge the text only in there, nothing else. So first of all, what we need to do is we need to go into settings. So find the grey settings cog there, tap it. Don't forget to like this video, share it and subscribe to my channel. Doing these three things will help us make more great videos for you. Then go into control center, which is on the left. Now, these instructions may well work on an iPhone as well. Don't know, haven't tested it, but uh, give it a try. This incidentally is iOS 15 that I'm using. Okay, so as I say, go into control center. Once you're in there, scroll all the way down. Okay, and we're looking for text size. So once you see text size, Tap on the plus just to the left of the two A's in the blue box there. And then what we need to do is let's just go back to general. So just tap general and then press the middle button on the front of the iPad or swipe upwards to get back to the main screen. Now what we need to do is we need to swipe down from the top right hand side of the iPad screen. So just move your finger just above the screen and then swipe down. OK, and then you get this little control center menu appear. Now, what we're looking for is we should have added these two A's to this control center menu. OK, so just make sure they're there. If they are, just tap away to get rid of it. If they're not, then go back into settings, control center and try adding it again. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into the app that we want to enlarge. So in my case, this is going to be emails. So just tap into emails. OK. There we go, there's, there's the emails come up. Swipe downwards at the top right of the screen to get this up again, okay? And then tap the two A's, so just tap there, okay? And there we go, so it, it asks us here the text size. What size do we want the text? At the moment, mine's set to 135%, but not only does it ask us um, how big or how small we want the text, but do we want this in all apps or do we want it in the mail app only? This is the app that we're currently in. So if I tap mail only, and there you go, whatever size I select there, it's only gonna affect that particular app. So in this case, it's only gonna affect the mail app. So let's just go in and swipe upwards to enlarge the text, okay? Tap away, anywhere away from the text size menu and the mail only and apps and tap again and there you go it has actually increased the size quite drastically of the uh, the actual content of the email but then if I go back and into any other app so say if I go into Chrome the text is still the same size now if I wanted to change the text in the Chrome app again I can just go in there go into the Chrome app tap or so swipe down from the top right hand side of the screen and then tap on the two a's and there you go that's set to 135 percent i can adjust that make it smaller if i want or larger let's make let's make the chrome size smaller okay and i'm going to select chrome only tap away tap again and there you go it's made the text smaller if I want to change it again, let's just tap, swipe down from the top right hand side of the screen, tap the two A's, and I'm going to change that back to 100%. So let's just do that. Let's select 100%, Chrome only, tap away, and there we go. So Chrome is at 100%, but if I go back to my emails, there you go, they're still enlarged. So that means that I've got two different font sizes for two different apps. Alternatively, you can also make it smaller. So let's just swipe down from the top right hand corner of the screen, tap the double A's and let's select the mail size, make it 100% or, or even make it 80%, make it smaller. Make sure that mail only is selected, tap away from the screen 
and there you go it's made it smaller so that is how you can basically change the size of the text on an iPad, possibly an iPhone too, on a app by app basis. I hope this guide helps. And if it did, don't forget, whilst you're at my YouTube channel, why not have a look around? I've got thousands of other videos covering all sorts of subjects. Hopefully you'll find something to educate you, entertain you, and maybe even amuse you. I hope you liked this video and if you did, hit that like button. If you think your friends, your family or your work colleagues might like it, then don't forget to share this on your social media timelines. And if you haven't done so already, make sure you find out about all my latest videos the second they're released. Hit that subscribe button, then hit the bell, then hit all. You can also find me on Twitter at CWTech and also find my website at cwtech.co.uk. Liking, sharing and subscribing really helps support this channel. Thank you very much.